Hey guys, this is Space, and welcome back to another Sims 3 speed build. It's been a long time since I've did one, did one of these, um, <clears throat> but I've decided um, that I would. Um, I kind of got some inspiration. Um, I fired up the Sims for the first time in a long time, and uh, I cranked out this house here. <laughs> so um, I hope you like it. Um, this is... I call it, uh, what, what do I call it, uh, Sims 3 Dutch inspired house, something along those lines because uh, I did go to Google Maps, uh, I went to like a random Dutch town and I made a house that I saw, so, or tried to at least, I added a little bit of my own imagination there, uh, especially with the floor plan and whatnot, but otherwise, um, yeah, this this thing is cool. Um, it's got a nice roof here. I like this roof. It, it's a little bit weird. I understand. I, I get it. I'm cool with that. Uh, but overall, I think it's a neat house. And I had fun building it, too. Um, I, I want to do more house builds. That's something I like to do. But I don't always have the ideas or the time. Well, okay. Let me tell you this. I have the time now, ladies and gentlemen. Um... I was gone for a long time from YouTube, um, in and out of it, kind of, making a few videos here and there, but not really fully in there. Um, I had school, school ended, I had a lot of baseball, summer leagues and everything like that, all-star tournaments, but they're done. I don't have any more, I have some time off for the summer, I'm excited because that means I get to do more of this, and I love doing this. Uh, I might do some Sims 3 live streams. I don't know. Not quite sure. Uh, but I might do that. So, we we shall see. Anyway, here is the front yard. Uh, a little bit of gravel in front. Got some hedges. Um, um, this house, actually, it's two hours of footage um, of me making the house. Uh, I've condensed it here into about 20 minutes. Ish. It's a little bit over uh, because of screenshots and everything, but um, I'm feeling like this is kind of the limit for how long house build should be for me, to be honest. Um, it kind of would have been awkward to split this into two really short 10-minute segments, but I feel like 20 minutes is pretty much the limit for how long I want one of these videos to be because i got to keep talking through the whole thing, and oh lord, that's interesting. You know, I, It's not really my jam, but, um, I feel like this is good, so, yeah, here we go, adding some windows, I, I did a lot of variety of windows, there's a lot of different styles that I used throughout this house, and I like that part of it, because it wasn't just the same thing over and over again, I really switched it up, and I, I liked how it looked when I did that, um, so that was a cool thing that I did, um, what else, I, I try to do better with interior decorating. Uh, I also try to do better with landscaping and everything. I'm not the number one interior designer. You know, that's that's for sure. Uh, and I, I'm not even on the map with, with uh, uh, landscaping. You know, I'd like to be good at landscaping because I've seen houses where they have really nice landscaping. And I think those are awesome. Um, but... Unfortunately for me, that's just not not really my thing. I would like to be good at it, but uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I don't think I could be. <laughs> so anyway, at the back here, there's sort of this. Um, I don't really know what you call it. It's not really a veranda. Maybe it is. I don't know. It's a porch kind of thing. Doesn't matter. It's there, <laughs> and uh, yeah, that's cool. Okay, here's the thing. Um, with this house, I love the kitchen. The kitchen is probably my favorite part of this house. I really like the kitchen. Um, it has cool... It I got... <clears throat> I was inspired by a picture. And it has this cool, like... I mean, you'll see it. You'll see it. It I, I really enjoy it. I wouldn't mind uh, having it in real life. This house, I wouldn't mind living in. In real life, in fact. But... Uh, Anyway, so here we go, coloring the windows now. I, I basically did them all white paint, pretty much, you know. Uh, some wood there, I thought that was, that was all right. Uh, same thing there with the fences. 
yeah, I thought this house would be kind of, it'd be good for a couple. Um, and it does have an extra room that I left blank because here's, here's kind of what I thought. Okay, I could turn this into an office, but the house definitely could be for more than just two people. It's on the smaller side, that's for sure. Uh, I mean, I like it, I like its size personally, but to some people it might seem small. So, I, I would really think, though, it's a good starter home for two people or, or a family of three. Because um, it could definitely turn in the extra room into an office or a bedroom, doesn't matter. Um... But anyway, yeah, so, you know, I, I liked it. Um, so, yeah. So, here we go, putting in some floor flooring right here. Those hedges clipped through the wall. I, I wasn't too jazzed about that. You know, I, I tried to fix it, and I, I think it did okay. But uh, uh, I also had to do some fixing with, um, you know, the way I did the kitchen. A counter was sticking out of the wall underneath the stairs, so... Um, to hide that, I put a bookcase there. You can't actually use the bookcase. Um, I've play tested the house. Everything else is fine. But, um, yeah, that bookcase you can't use. It's, it's just for decoration to hide, um, the, uh, what's it called? The counter. There you go. So, here we go. Coloring, like, the attic and spaces where people don't go black um i like doing that and uh, it just kind of separates things a little bit so that's sort of the idea behind there um so yeah continuing on this house is kind of expensive it's not technically a starter home but i might do a starter home sometime in the future uh, depends on when you, what you guys would want to see but uh anyway other news about The Sims 3, though. Well, more more not The Sims 3. The Sims 4. The Sims 4 is indeed coming out soon. Uh, in September. I believe September. That's uh, two months from now. Um, you know, here's the thing. I like it. Don't get me wrong. I like The Sims. But I'm just not there with it. I, I don't... To me, it just seems too not lifelike, you know? So, I kind of, um, I don't know. It it just, I don't think I'll be buying it. Um, I like The Sims 3. You know, I spent my money on The Sims 3, too. So, um, personally, uh, a lot of people are going to have The Sims 4, do house builds with Sims 4. Ooh, look at this, new features, everything. But, uh, I'm staying with Sims 3. So, if I ever do Sims, it's, it's Sims 3. You can... Pretty much bet on that one. Anyway. So, let's get into sports news because there's some big news coming on right now in the sports world. Uh, LeBron James. Um, I don't know how many of you actually care about this, but uh, he's going back to Cleveland. If you care about it, you already know what you know what the Cavaliers are and everything and the heat in that situation. If you don't know about it, don't worry. Don't even just forget that I ever said that. But, uh, anyway, uh, how about that? So, anyway, working on some curtains here in, like, the dining room. I like this dining room. It turned out, uh, pretty good to me. Uh, or, I mean, yeah, it looks good to me. Um, and then it goes off to the kitchen. I added a little bit of, of, uh, curtains there. I sort of tried to make the curtains fun a little bit. I, I don't know if I really did that, but, uh, I tried. I tried. I actually did, I spent a lot of time, um, trying to furnish well. I hope you like my attempt, to be honest. I, I, I normally don't like doing this, but I think it looks cool when people actually do this and it looks good. Um, so I tried. I tried. It's actually where a lot of my time was spent, was just looking through things like this. You know. I could use collections, uh, but, uh. You know, I, I haven't played the game for so long that I really don't know what I usually use. So, uh, if I, if you guys like this and, and you want, you know, more of these, obviously tell me because uh, uh, I may just do them if I get the inspiration. So anyway, still working on the dining room here. It does take a while, but I like how it turns out. It it feels homey. Uh, you know, it's it's cool. 
I enjoyed it. Um, but uh, I'm just waiting for the kitchen. Oh, another thing about about uh, when I furnished this. Every room was basically done in a totally separate recording session. Um, just for the fact that I'd finish a room, I'd be like, okay, that's the next room. Well, I've spent too much time on this one. I'm just going to forget that and move on. So, yeah, it, it, that's why it kind of took a while. But, uh, anyway. Here's this little uh, bookshelf and... Uh, kind of end table sort of thingy. Um, I like those those shoes and, and like the gym bag. I thought that was cool. Um, you saw a lot of orange here in the in the dining room. I liked orange. Um, the Dutch uh, national color is orange, so I guess that's a cool thing too. Um, so anyway. Here is the kitchen. Yes, this is the coolest kitchen I think I've ever made, and I really like it. It all works. It's functional. It's It's cool. And man, I love it. Um, it's kind of small. It takes up the whole room. Uh, but I really love that diagonal there. Because in the diagonal, I place the sink. And it, it creates such a good work triangle. I just really enjoy that. Now here's a little little island off to the side here. I do put bar stools in. And they do work. I've play tested them. Both seats work. You can sit at them, walk behind them, everything. They're functional. So that's cool. Um, yeah, yeah, everything works. Um, I really love this house. I really like how it turned out. And, uh, yeah, I thought it was cool. Anyway, we're working on the counters. Got a black countertop and white, um, everything else. <laughs> I thought that was nice. Uh, it was just a very pleasant house. Um, but anyway... Yeah, I don't know. Um, I kind of want to make a venue one time, but the thing with a venue is, it's like, I could do it. Uh, sure, I could do it, but I don't know. The problem is, it's such a big space, and I wouldn't really know what to put in there. Like, if I made a club, all right, I get the idea. You got your dance floor, you got your bar and everything, you got your bathrooms, obviously, but I don't know where I go from there, you know. I would be interested in building with someone else. Um, I build the building, they do furnishing, stuff like that, that's fine, but, uh, um, you know, uh, I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, uh, finishing off the kitchen soon, I like that painting, I really like that painting, actually, I thought that was cool. Also a mirror here, I thought that was cool too. Mirrors and kitchens, I don't have a mirror in my kitchen, but, uh, I think it's cool anyway. I guess it's alright. <laughs> So anyway, yeah, soon to be done with this, and uh, a little bit of curtains there. Oh yeah, and on the outside here, I added these awnings over these side windows. I just thought it was a little touch that, that I liked, and so I kept it, um, and that's what I did. All right, so here we go into a new recording session. Obviously, you can see it is evening time in the game. I switched this soon enough, I think, so don't worry. Actually, I think I switched it after I realize I can't see what I'm doing with the fireplace. Um, so yeah, there's a fireplace here too. So that's cool. Uh, making that carpet match the other one down below. I thought it turned out pretty nice. I really enjoyed I I've said this too much now. There, there it is, daytime. <sighs> but I, I really do like the house. It just, I'm keen on it. Very keen. Alright, so... I spoke earlier about live streams. Oh, and by the way, here's the bookshelf thing. That is, it, you can't use it, um, but it's there. Anyway, I spoke earlier about live streams and live streaming The Sims. I did it before um, in a Luna Island with this one lot that I never even finished. It's not finished, uh, but I had a good time doing that stream. I had a, lot, I had a few people out there that were good people and... Uh, I had a good time. Uh, so I might do a live stream of a house again. Um, I'm not sure how many people would want to see me do like an, an LP of The Sims. Uh, you know, that's something that could happen, but I don't know. We'll see. Here we go, working on this living room now. Got that rug in there. Got got a light, a TV, fireplace. 
a few plants. I thought that was nice. Uh, adding in this, this little pokey poker thingy. That was cool. And some... What do I put here? Oh, yeah. Those things were cool. Those, like, feather things. Those were neat. So I definitely added them in there. And then some little crate crate dealy bobs over there. So it was nice. And um, I don't think I put anything else on the wall over there. Here was sort of like a little recreation area-ish, kind of. I put a fool's ball... Fool's ball. Foosball table in that corner. Um, and like a backpack there. The foosball table, it works on the one side. I don't think you could play with two people. But, but I have tested it with one person, and you can definitely use it on that one side, so... Uh, you can. It's functional. So. Anyway, now moving on to the upstairs brand new recording session. Uh, working on the master bedroom. Uh, this is the only furnished bedroom in the house, but you can see off to the right there, the wood floor place. Uh, that's the that's the place where the um, uh, extra room is. So if you did want to use that extra room as a bedroom, you can, or an office, even another rec room. It doesn't really matter. Evil lair. It's all there. So anyway. Uh, master bedroom here. I picked sort of a color that I wanted for it. It was like this light teal. I thought it was okay. I might have gone too overboard with it. Though. Um, so I'm not too sure. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Uh, that's, that's not really my decision. So anyway. <sighs> this has been... Uh, Coming up on 17 minutes, that's cool. Um, I'm surprised this house actually took so long. I didn't think it was going to. It's not too big of a house or anything, but it did take a while, so... Uh, anyway. Oh, one thing to note, by the way. There isn't a garage. There's only a driveway on the side of the house. So, if you like having your car covered in The Sims, even though it doesn't really matter, I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> you can't cover your car in The Sims in this house if you download it um, which I may put the download link in the description I don't know if I will I don't know if I'll remember that's the thing uh, but I might possibly do that so that's cool um, there's a plane going by outside I don't think you can hear it but if you can good on you good on you uh, it's kind of quiet probably anyway adding a rug here with the, with the colors those are cool I like that rug, actually. But yeah, it, definitely a big theme going on with that teal and dark blue, so... Mm, not sure. Um, okay, here is the bathroom. Well, the master bathroom. There is two ba... ba um, whew, words. There is two bathrooms in the house. Oh, I'm sorry. There's a dog in the house right now. I can't do anything about it. In real life. Um, anyway... Um, as I was saying, wow, I've, I've totally lost everything. Thanks to that dog. Yeah, yeah. Um, alright. Working on this bathroom here. Um, two sinks here. The other one doesn't have, it only has one sink. Um, but it does connect to the hallway. This one is just an ensuite to the master bedroom. Um, the other one is actually, uh, it's just right off the upstairs hallway, so. Um, no big deal there. Putting in this little, it was like, that's, 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 a, that's a grass rug um, in the bathroom there. So anyway, got two towels here. Uh, sort of did like opposite colors on them. Well, not opposite colors, but like the pattern. Gray on one, silver on the other. Uh, these towels, hand towels, going to give them a cool design there. And put a light... Um, I didn't add a light in that, uh, shower and, and toilet room, so, oops, um, if you want to do that, go ahead, <laughs> I kind of forgot, but oh well, um, alright, here we go, soon we'll be working on the other bathroom, I think, um, just working on this hallway real quick, that's kind of a bare hallway, oh well. Here's the here's the last bathroom. I think this is the last room inside the house that I work on. I believe it is. Uh, and then uh, we do the outside soon. This is pretty simple. Nothing too fancy in here. It's your standard bathroom. Everything works. Everything's good. You know how it is. 
Um, I believe, anyway. I hope everything's good. If it's not, I'm sorry. Anyway. Working on that rug. Got sort of a royal blue and a gold going on in there. Got a plant. Another towel. A little bit of a painting there. And single light in the extra room. So now we're in the backyard. Um, got a little bit of a barbecue down there. A little bit of a pond over here. Not bad, not bad. Um, I usually don't do things like this just because I don't know anyone who has a pond in their backyard in real life. So... Um, I, it's just, it's kind, of, it's kind of unusual to me that someone would actually have a pond in their back. Well, a pond as big as that, I guess. Um, yeah. So anyway, here we go. I worked in this little flower bed. I thought this was kind of cool. Uh, it's just kind of some color to the backyard, you know. They already had that kind of outer white fence to this place, so that was sort of my, my barrier anyway. All right, there you go. There's some seats. Uh, simple barbecue or, or pit there and just gonna add some plants to the front here and we're gonna be done very soon oh I moved the mailbox and the other guy there too there we go all right hey here's the screenshots so there's the house from the front I think it looks pretty nice uh, it looks nice and pleasant there uh, there's a cool view of it from the back yeah I, I like it it's it's cool there's a nice backyard shot. And there's a view out from the porch there. Looking good to me. And now we're inside to that sweet kitchen that I really like. I think that's so awesome. Uh, here's, here's the dining room. Uh, but anyway, we're going to wrap this thing up pretty soon. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. Um, possibly future house videos in the, in the future. Uh, but I want to thank you guys for watching. My name is Bass. Make sure to like this video if you did enjoy it and subscribe for more if uh, I ever get around to doing that. So, anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this episode of, Sim well, of A Sims 3 Speed Build. <laughs> and I'll see you next time. Bye.